Hey guys, Brent Tech here, bringing you another RuneScape video. Now, um, the clip that you're gonna that you're seeing right now is actually me doing a Slayer task after being gone for RuneScape for a little bit. Cause uh, if you guys live in America, um, I'm sure most of you do. Um, some of you might be in the UK or Canada, but um, uh, school has started back after Christmas break. Um, for most of you, so um, that's very unfortunate for RuneScape content making, but. Um, this is the video that I've uh, managed to capture before, you know, before, uh, I mean, before I went to school. Uh, so, yeah, guys, um, and my membership is almost out. It's I think it's running out today, so I'm trying to record as much clips as I can to produce to you guys. But if not, if I can't make a video um, next week, um, that's probably why. Um, I know I should buy bonds, and uh, but uh, I really don't want to waste my... 80 mil i'm two, 20 mil away and um i've been playing runescape scarcer and scarcer so um you know every little gp actually counts and um that's why i'm collecting these infernal lashes even though they're about 800k to 1 mil an hour um i think they're still worth it uh for my slayer task but anyways uh this leads me on to my topic and um by the way guys i'm trying to make this video short like around five to six minutes because you guys um apparently like shorter videos um, up to my money making ones um, but um, the topic that I'm going to be uh, talking about is what happens when RuneScape dies like I know I think someone made a video on this I think it might be Jim Sauce or some RuneScape commentator who makes like random commentary videos sometimes but I really forgot who it was but um, I think they uh, they implied it to what will Jagex do but for me, I'm going to apply it to you guys as the players because you, we have no power to Jagex. We can't really contro control what they do, you know. And um, it's more relatable if uh, I make a commentary about what we will do instead of what Jagex will do. So I'm, I'm not saying that this commentary is mine um, by any means, so please don't say it. Um, I really forgot who it's from, but if you guys will leave it in the comment section below, feel free. But um, anyways, guys, um, what will you guys do? Um, when RuneScape is down, uh, my prediction is uh, RuneScape will start shutting down once uh, they are not making enough money or their players are slowly dwindling to about five to ten thousand, and they can't keep up their server. They can't uh, keep up the payments for their uh, team, for their servers and stuff. And that's when I personally think it's gonna go down. Um, I personally think that Jackix is operating almost at a loss because of bonds. Uh, mo now nowadays uh, most players are using bonds to buy a runescape membership um, that's what i should do if i played more but um yeah guys uh since bonds are about seven mil or eight mil and you get 14 days and uh, you basically only need to make around at least two mil a day so that's like one frost dragon trip at least a day so um if you just if you play for uh, two hours a day you should be able to make your you should be able to make 14 mil in profit so I really Jagex isn't making money at that rate. Um, I know that there's Squeal of Fortune, and you know I don't really know how many people buy Squeal of Fortunes, but Squeal of Fortune actually uh, helps the game. You could just it's pretty much spin to win, um, just like a League of Legends thing. But um, if you pay enough money, um, you should you you will it's the fastest amount of XP you will get in the game ever, and you might actually get some rare stuff. But um, anyways. Uh, once RuneScape uh, starts running out of funds, um, I personally think it's gonna go down. And um, what will we do, guys? Um, personally, what I'm gonna do after RuneScape is down is I might uh, play another uh, online game or maybe play a RuneScape private server. Um, I'm pretty sure a private server is gonna rise up from the ground to take pl uh, uh, one main private server is gonna take. Uh, and like dominate and be the new quote-unquote RuneScape, while Jagex figures something out uh, once they, while they are down. And um, I personally think I will be playing a little bit of private servers to get the nostalgia back if RuneScape ever goes down. Um, and also, uh, I'll also be playing some other games. Uh, I'd actually invest more money um, in Steam games and uh, like uh, MOBA games, like League of Legends or guild wars and stuff i won't be playing as much runescape uh, i play runescape well it, it, it's still fun to a certain extent but you know um 
with the new updates it's been kind of getting repetitive because not a lot of people actually do these new updates so even though they're good xp and stuff because i'm kind of fishy of trying something new but um yeah guys that's probably what i'm going to be doing and um i'm sure you guys as uh runescape players will probably do the same thing um i'm sure you guys will play a private server i'm pretty sure of that and I'm, I'm pretty sure you, uh, you guys are probably going to be uh, playing some, uh, buying an Xbox One or something and play Call of Duty or Battlefield 4. Some other games to keep your mind off of it, you know, but to get the nostalgia back that I miss if RuneScape ever goes down, I will probably be playing a private server because I'm sure a really good private server will arise from the ground um, once RuneScape is down to take its place. And um, personally... Uh, if I have to give a estimate on this, it is about another, let's, uh, a safe number is about four to five years maybe before this, before my prediction starts happening. Um, at the rate RuneScape is going, because it's, the community is split and stuff. Now, I still enjoy the game, but I really think Jack yeah, needs to be make better updates to prevent this and, um. That's probably what I'm going to be doing if RuneScape ever goes down in the next four to five years. Um, that's my prediction. But by that, by that time, I'll probably be in college. And um, I probably won't, won't be playing this game too much anyways. So, um, yeah, guys. Um, I hope you guys like this video. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it. Um, comment uh, if you have any more questions or criticisms. And what will you do if RuneScape is down? Um, will you guys play a private server? Will you guys uh, invest in new games? Will you guys buy consoles? Will you guys build a gaming PC? Um, gaming PC is a is a cost-effective way to game, um, if you know what I mean. But and because of Steam summer sales and or Steam sales and some other miscellaneous stuff um, that I'm sure you guys know what I'm talking about. And um, yeah, guys, leave your comments uh, in the comment section below and answer those questions please um i'd be i'd love to hear your answers and subscribe for more future content guys um sorry if i don't make a video next week it's just that my membership runs out and i don't know when i'm gonna go to the store yet but um yeah guys i hope you guys uh enjoy this video so comment like subscribe and have a good day guys bye